I'm Rachel and welcome back to my channel Bales 1986 SW. Today is Thursday so that is a weigh in update. I have been weighed after two weeks being off plan. Well I say two weeks being off plan, I've been one week completely off plan. I've never even thought about Slimming World. Um, the first week I was on plan, I completely enjoyed it, I had a few treats um, and then I didn't get weighed on Thursday. You know that um, because I did a weigh in update with no way in kind of thing. Um, then this week I have been to Cornwall and there is lots of Cornwall holiday vlogs up there. It may not be something you enjoy those vlogs um, because you're just interested in my weight loss journey or um, my Friday finds and everything like that and that's completely fine. Um, that is just somewhere where I like to store all my memories made and if you're interested in watching it and get to know me and my family then there you go. Um, but they're just special memories which I'm lucky enough that I can capture them and uh, make them into vlogs. So, holiday. Um, I don't like doing confessionals, I don't like telling you everything what I've eaten, um, but I have been off plan. I have not thought about Slimming World one bit. I've had alcoholic drinks which I don't normally have, I've had Malibu and, lemon, uh, Malibu and pineapple juice, um, I've had Cornish cream teas, Cornish pastas. I've had a lot of what I would say naughty food and I've thoroughly enjoyed it. And there's no regrets because I just, I've had a wonderful time with, with my family. I'm not saying that food isn't a massive thing without having f this kind of food would make my time any less valuable or memorable or anything like that. I'm not saying that, all I'm saying is that I've just not thought about what I'm eating. I've looked at the menu and gone, I fancy that, I'm gonna have that. I'm not looking at the menu and thinking, what's the best option on there? Um, and if like one day I had a vegan tray, which would have been a few sins for the sweet potato fries, but everything else would have been within sins, or you can use so, so much with a healthy egg kind of thing. Um, but it's just because I fancied it, not because it was the best option on that menu. And I've loved it. I have just absolutely loved it. I came back on Sunday afternoon and I have then just carried it on. Now, I th could. I thought to myself, I'd get back on Sunday, I'd have a Chinese because we had no food in until the Monday. I'd have had a, a Chinese, after the Chinese um, takeaway meal, I would have then on the Monday been back to plan. But I got back to... Um, so on Monday I thought I'm going back, going back to basics and everything like that and I haven't, I've just rolled on with it. And I think sometimes it's hard to get back into the momentum and I thought Thursday I'm going to get weighed, I'm going to step into a brand new week and that's it and that's what I've done. So I got weighed today, I haven't got my book and um, so I will... Um, try and insert a photograph from my book here. If not, if I haven't got time, then you just got to believe me. Um, I gained eight and a half pounds um, this week and um, that takes me to a four stone and two and a half pound loss. So I'm well out of my target range. And I, I'm, I can't sit here and say I'm not bothered because that would be the wrong mindset to say. But I've accepted that gain. I've enjoyed all that food with that gain and I'm back to plan. I'm back to being a newbie um, as well. I Today I got weighed, had a cup of coffee, I went to the cafe um, and I had a jug of potato with no butter with some cheese and beans and a side salad and I thoroughly enjoyed it with a cappuccino which would have been uh, my milk allowance. And tonight um, I'm having beef stir fry with noodles and I'm really enjoying it. So whatever will be next week off those scales there will be a loss next week because i want to see i want to chip away at this weight gain and get back to my lower end of my target and i think that's just part of being honest that i've that's it i've i can't say anything more i've enjoyed my food i've enjoyed my holiday i've accepted my gain and this week will be 100 percent on plan now what I will say, it is hard because the children are off school and the routine is to pot. Um, but I am trying my best. 
the weekends are my weakness um but the husband is working um this weekend um so there'll be no temptation to have like a chinese or anything like that i am going um to town i mean going to doncaster to do a bit of retail shopping with my mother-in-law while the boys are at football and with grace um but i will be on plan i probably end up going to subway for a subway salad which will be 100 percent on plan i'll avoid the taco bell because that is my downfall um and I'll make the best choices. I've got all my food in um, already um, for the week ahead. I've got pineapple in, which I love. I'm obsessed with pineapple. Pineapple, melon. I've got, um, what else have I got? Nectarines, peaches, strawberries. I've got some naughty little treats for uh, my evening, for my evening snacks. I'm bringing back my treat bowls, which is, I, I love those. And I haven't done a treat bowl in ages. Um, so I'm going to bring those back because I miss them. Um, and I'm going to enjoy my week being a newbie and whatever will be on those scales will be I know there will be a loss uh, because I am food optimizing a hundred percent this week um, and I'm trying to have breakfast lunch and tea um, because I need that because I have been missing my breakfast even being away on holiday I have a cup of coffee and then I'll have my dinner and I'm missing my breakfast and I think my breakfast if I have a good breakfast, it will fill me up and I won't snack. Even though I might be snacking on like strawberries and things like that, um, I want a good a, a good breakfast to fill me up. So that is it. I hope you've had a brilliant week on plan. As ever, food optimising, sending huge positive thoughts. Rachel, bye!